Wow. Normally I would say hats off, job well done. But Samsung and Google, wake up on the J2. This is the worst piece of vaporware I have dealt with since the incarnation of flip phones. The amount of error messages I'm getting on beta de developing software and other shit that should not be having these type of hiccups is beyond intolerable. Especially when I'm using the backbone with Fort Knox encryption and locking this thing down tighter than the Pentagon. There is no excuse for these kind of continued hiccups because all my stuff is totally, 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 totally frickin' current as you can see from both sides. So unless you guys are going to fault this on T-Mobile, Metro, PCS, or somebody else, I, I'm, I'm just, you know, aside from the flyover sweeps I get periodically from DOD or others, wiping my signal clean and my battery and... <clears throat> If I'm not in full stealth mode, um, you know, I've learned to tolerate that. I can go recharge. But when I'm trying to get up news and information, and I'm spending more than 50% of my time trying to fix vaporware so I can even get a lock to load, trying to do live re pre-recorded is pretty much almost bullshit at this point. I do better on a Motorola iMoto right now with better stability than I'm getting off this J2. And I have been a big Samsung booster for years, but this one's got so many cracks in it, my ass is feeling raw. So why don't you guys fix this vaporware bullshit or somebody's going to owe me one fuck of a big upgrade if I get any more IP crashes like I'm getting while I'm trying to develop shit because it really pisses me right the fuck off. I, with that, we'll start with restraint of trade and then we'll fuck you in the ass in federal court until I'm done bleeding you dry. So fix your bullshit.